let's talk a little bit about items of equipment and nesting them within other items. Here, we're inside a search and rescue drone workshop. We'll focus on a few sample items on the counter. Here, we have a list of items and some cases that these items will be housed in. After this, we'll then move those cases into different compartments in the back of our vehicle. The items on display here are a DJI Inspire 2 drone, a Crystal Sky display, an iPad, two DJI controllers, six batteries, a drone case, and a battery case. First, let's move those six batteries into the battery case. We know that the six batteries and the battery case are located in the drone workshop. First, we navigate to the Locations tab and then select Move Items. We open up our drone workshop or else we can search the reference if we know it. Now, we drag the six batteries across to the right hand side of the page. We do not drag the case across. Once we have the six batteries moved across the screen, we then select Move Selected Equipment. Here we see that we are already in the drone workshop, but we need to go a level deeper. Now, if we go back to Categories and find the battery case, you will see that it is located in the drone workshop as expected. And if we click into it and scroll down, we will see that the contents of the case, which are six batteries. Now, just as we did with the batteries, we could move all of the equipment with the drone and nest it within the drone case using the exact same steps. This is now complete. Here we have two fully loaded cases that we now want to move into a compartment of the vehicle. Again, we go to the Locations tab and select Move Items. We locate the first case, which is a UAV case, and drag it to the right hand side of the page. We want to put this in the lower rear compartment of Disco 3. We choose Move Selected Equipment. Now we navigate to the vehicle bay and then to Disco 3 and then to compartment Disco 3 rear low. Once we're happy, we select Move. The UAV case is now loaded into the correct compartment as shown here. To move the other, we'll go through the same process. We drag the UAV battery case to the right hand side of the page, drill down until we find the correct compartment which in this case is Disco 3 Rear Up. Again, this is now complete. If we navigate to our vehicle and look at its contents, you'll see both of those compartments now contain items. This figure isn't just one item in each compartment because we know those cases also contain items nested within them.